คนที่เข้ามาใหม่นะคะให้ทำตามข้อตกลงในการเรียนผ่านซูมบนกระดานที่คุณครูแชร์ด้วยนะคะรับทราบควรอีกครั้งนะคะข้อหนึ่งให้ทุกคนตั้งชื่อของตัวเองนะคะชื่อจริงนามสกุลจริงชั้นเลขที่เป็นภาษาอังกฤษเพื่อที่คุณครูจะได้ทำการเช็คชื่อได้นะคะข้อสองไม่เปิดไมค์คุยเล่นกันในขณะที่เรียนนอกจากว่าทิเชอร์นะคะจะถามเด็กๆให้ตอบข้อนี้ข้อนี้เราถึงจะสามารถเปิดไมค์ได้นะคะข้อสามให้ทุกคนเปิดกล้องในขณะที่เรียนตลอดเวลานะคะและข้อสี่พยายามที่จะไม่ให้มีเสียงพัดลมเสียงพูดคุยหรือเสียงโทรทัศน์จากทางบ้านเข้ามาในไมค์เพื่อเป็นการรบกวนเพื่อนๆนะคะโอเคโอเค good morning everyone how are you today I'm fine thank you okay very good how about the others Tim Press how are you today I'm fine thank you you're fine thank you okay are you are you ready to learn new lesson Yes. Okay. Okay. But before that, let's review first our lesson last time. What did we talk about last time? We talk about what? What did we talk about last m o n uh, Tuesday? Last Tuesday, we talk about the five stages of human growth and development, right? Yes or no? Yes. What are those five again? What are the five stages of human growth and development? We have infancy. Infancy. What else? We also have childhood. The next one we have what? Adolescence. Next, adulthood, and the last stage is. The last stage is old age. Okay, it's on your book. You can follow your book for this one. Okay, now for today's lesson, we're going to talk about the changes that occur in every stage of human growth and development. It's just the same from last time. We will just make the discussion more un understandable for you. Okay. All right. Now let's proceed to infancy. Again, when we say infancy, these are the babies from birth to two years old, right? Yes or no? Yes. Okay. Now I have. We have here two two columns: their age and and the skills they can do with this age. Okay. Now let's begin with birth. Birth. Okay. This is probably the babies, uh, just for one week or two weeks. Okay. Now, what are the things they can do? They listen to the sound of those around them. Yes, they are just listening to the sound of those around them. Next, startled by loud, no loud noise, and they cry a lot. Okay. Next one. One to three months. When a baby is around one to three months, they can recognize familiar voices. They can recognize your mom, your dad, their brother and sister, and their sister's voices. Okay, and they express themselves by bubbling and body movement. What do we mean by bubbling? Bubbling. How do babies talk? They talk like mama, papa. That's bubbling. Okay. And next one, body movement. How do they express by body move? How do they express themselves by body movement? They are crawling a lot. They are moving a lot. Understand? That's that's during one, two, three months. Next, four to six months. They are interested in sound and rhythm. That's why some babies are watching Coco Melons, right? They enjoy watching Coco Melons and other nursery sounds. Next, during seven to twelve months, they recognize the name of familiar objects and people. They know how to name some things like spoon, fork, pencil, like that. Okay. 
Next, during one to two years, they can follow simple command. Just like, for example, when, when, their mom, when their mom say to them, sit down, they will sit down. Keep quiet, they will keep quiet. Next, they can imitate words and phrases that people, that people around them use. Okay, yes, they can imitate words. That's why we have to be careful of our words when we are around kids because they are imitating us. They might, they might copy what we are saying. Understand? Yes? Okay, next. No, Lyle. Huh? <laughs> Next one, let's proceed to childhood. When we say childhood, as I told you last time, these are the child around 3 to 11 years old, just like you, right? Okay, now what are the things they can do? During 3 to 4 years old, they start to walk back, backwards and side to side. They also climb stairs. Now, do you agree with this one? Do you agree with, with this one? You can turn on your mic and answer, teacher. Yes. They can climb the stairs, yes. For their gross motor skill, they can turn the pages of a book. They can unbutton and button up clothing. And they can hold a pencil and crayon. That's, that's when they are three to four years old. Understand? Yes? Yes or yes? Yes. <laughs> okay, next one. During four to five years, they can hop on one foot. They can walk and run. Do you agree with this one? Four to five years old. Yes. Yes, you can. And they start to use a spoon and fork. It's not knife, huh? It's a spoon. It's not knife. This is a typographical error. It's spoon and fork. Do you agree with this one? During four to five years old, they can hold the spoon and fork. Yes or no? It's it's not knife. knife. Spoon. It's not knife. It's spoon. Yeah. I type it wrong. Can. Can. Okay. They can hold spoon and fork during four to like, during four to five years old. Next. During five to six years old, they can start, they start to jump and they can skip. Yes. Skip. They, yes, skip. And they they can confidently use a fork and spoon. They can steadily hold a pencil and they are learning how to write. Understand? That's during five to six years yes. old. These are probably the P1 student or Anuban 3 student. Do you agree with this one? Yes. 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 Okay. Next one. We still have here. During, yes. Yeah. During six to seven years old, they ride a bike. Do you know how to ride a bike? I know you're around seven years old or eight years old. I'm eight. Okay. Do you know how to ride a bike? Yes. Okay. They jump confidently. <laughs> they run with coordination. Next, for their gross motor skill, they have fully developed hand-eye coordination. They can draw complex shapes. They can write their full names and they can write short sentences. Do you agree with this one? During seven, yes. six to seven years old, do you already know how to write your name? Yes. Do you already know how to draw shapes? Yes. Yes, okay. Now, from seven to eight years old, they can hop on both legs. They can balance themselves. Can you balance yourselves? Yes or no? Can you balance yourselves? Yes. Yes, okay. Can cut using scissors. Do you know how to use scissors during this age? Seven to year eight? Yes. Yes, of course. Okay, next one, we still have 9 to 11 years old. 11 years old, okay. Maybe more coordinated and get better at things like kicking, throwing, catching, and showing balance. Okay, during 9 years old, they become more coordinated. They can kick, they can throw, and they can catch. Understand? Next, 
For their gross motor skill, some kids will take a leap forward in sports like soccer, baseball, or basketball. They also may start to see themselves as athletic or unathletic. Okay, for this stage, you you will you will know if you're good at basketball, soccer, baseball, like that. You will know if you're athletic or you're not, or you're unathletic during this age. Do you understand that? Where you where are you good at? What sport do you play right now? Football. What? No, basketball. You're playing basketball, Sherman. Yes. How about the others, Supawit? What sport can you play right now? What sport can you play right now? Supawit. Dancing. Oh, dancing. <laughs> dancing on TikTok? Sherman. <laughs> Basketball. So but we can play basketball. How about Palawat? What sport can you play right now? Palawat. Football. Football. Very good. How about the others? Is Meta here? Oh, no Meta. Meta likes. How about God? God what sport can you play? What sport can you play? Hmm? Gotten? Are you listening? What sport can you play right now? Gotten! Oh, Gotten is so busy. Okay, 9 to 11 years old. Again, you will know if you're athletic or unathletic. Now, let's proceed to the next stage. What's the next stage after childhood? Adolescent. Adolescence. Okay. These are the people ages 12 to 18 years old. Okay. Now, during this stage, puberty happens. Okay. Now, what is puberty? What is puberty? Do you know what a puberty is? Yes. What? Puberty is stage of our life and there are lots of changes happens in our physical body. Understand? All right, now let's proceed to boys. For boys, puberty happens when they are 12 to 16 years old. Understand? Remember that one. For boys, puberty happens when they are 12 to 16 years old. What age for boys again? So, Poet, are you singing? <laughs> what age yes, for yes. Boys? What age for boys again? Puberty happens when they are what age? 12 to 16 years old. Okay, now what are the changes in a boy going through puberty? Okay, first they grow facial, facial hair, underarm hair, and pubic hair. มีผลขึ้นตามส่วนต่างๆของร่างกายอันนี้คือการสมัยนี้นะคะคือการเปลี่ยนแปลงทางด้านร่างกายของเด็กหนุ่มวัยแรกรุ่นค่ะข้อที
Are your shoulders wide at your age? No, because you're still in childhood stage. Okay, next one. Their voices become deeper. Yes. Do you understand this one? Do you have any questions about this? Now I want to ask you, do you have underarm hair? Do you have underarm uh, hair right now? Why? No way. <laughs> Why? Why do you think so that you still don't have this underarm hair? I am childhood. Because you're in childhood. But when you reach adolescence, you will experience this all. Understand? You will grow facial hair and underarm hair. Understand? Cool. Yes, you do. Okay, next one. For most girls, puberty happens when they are 10 to 14 years old. For boys earlier, it's 12 to 16, right? Now for girls, it's 10 to 14 years old. Now what are the things, what are the changes in a girl going through puberty? First, girls start to have menstruation each month. Their ovaries starts to produce egg cells which are needed for reproduction. Understand this? Yes? Yes. Okay. Yes. That's why you notice some of the teenagers, even us, even me, I'm having a monthly period and it really hurt, right? And I am telling you that don't be so noisy today because I'm not feeling well, right? Remember those times? Okay. Next one. They grow hair on different parts of their body. Just like boys, we, girls also grow underarm hair. Yes, we also have underarm hair. Try to ask your mom. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Next one, their breasts develop. And sweat gland increases. They are sweating a lot. Next one, their hips widen. Yes, they start to have this shape. They start to become sexier, okay? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now, what are the common changes for both girls and boys during puberty? Okay. First, height and mass increase. They become taller and they gain weight. Okay, next, physical strength increases. Next, higher, they need, they, higher need of sleep, they need to sleep a lot of time. Okay, sweat gland increase. They sweat a lot, as I told you earlier. And they become more mature in decision making. And their reproductive organ develops. Okay, do you, <laughs> do you understand this one? These are the changes that occur during puberty or adolescence stage. Understand? Yes or no? Yes or no? Yes or yes? Yes. 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 All yes. right, now let's yes. proceed to adulthood. Everybody say adulthood. 
adult food. These are the people ages 19 to 65 years old. Okay. Now, during adult adulthood, most are physically mature. Stable stage whereby not many physical changes occur. Meaning to say, puberty end to this stage. Understand? Understand? They are physically mature. Understand? Yes? Can you give me an example of an adult? Yeah. Uh, give me an example of an adult. Am I an adult? Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Is Supawit an adult? No. No. Supawit is yeah. in what stage? Childhood. Supawit is in what stage? Childhood. Childhood. Okay. Next one. Adults may reproduce and start their families. Just like you. You already have your families because your mom and your dad are, are already in adulthood stage. They are in stable stage. They can support you. That's why they can produce families. Understand? Yes. 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 Okay. Yes. And the last stage is the. What's the last stage? What's the last stage? Old age. Old, old age. age. These are the people above sixty-five years old. Okay. All right. It says here that their eyesight may start to weaken. Do you agree with this one? Yes. Yes. yes, there. Elderly people experience muscle and bone loss, or their muscles start to weaken. And they love to exercise. <laughs> yes, they love to exercise. Next, their hair starts turning gray and, beg and begins to thin. Those are the changes that may happen during old age. Yes. Uh, can you give me an example of an old age? Your grandma and your grandpa. Okay. All right. Now let's review. Let's review. I will ask you. Okay. This age. is the stage where where a person can jump and can hop. Infancy, childhood. Childhood. What? Childhood. Childhood. Very good. This is the stage where they can only express themselves by bubbling. Bub, bub. Infancy. Infancy. How about the others? Only Sherman is answering me. Okay, this is the stage where a person can ride a bike. Child, childhood. Okay, next. This is the stage where a person is physically mature. Adulting. Huh? Adulting. Physically mature. Childhood. Physically mature. What? What stage? Adolescence or adulthood? Adulthood. Adulthood. This is the newborn. Stage. Huh? Newborn. Newborn. <laughs> no. Another information. When a baby just bo when a baby a baby from birth to two months are called as newborn. Understand? Newborn. Yes. That's from birth up to two months only, okay? Newborn. Yes. How about the five-month-old baby? Can we call them newborn? Infancy. No, infancy. Okay. All right. Now, this is the stage where people experience muscle and bone. Adolescent. Hi? Adolescent. Bone loss? 
Uh, uh, old age. Old age. This I is the experience a lot of changes in their physical body. A lot of Can you repeat it again? Hmm? Can you repeat it again? Okay. This is the stage where people experience a lot of changes in their physical body. Uh, 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 uh. Just like um, widened shoulders. Menstruation for girls. What stage is that? Adolescence. Adolescence, okay. Next, this is the stage where a person plays a lot. They play Child. a lot. Childhood. Childhood. Okay. Ooh. Now, do you have any question about this? No. About our lesson? No, okay. Don't forget that we call a baby from birth up to two months a newborn, okay? Birth to two months, we call them newborns, okay? Yes? Yes? Okay. Now, if you want to read this topic, you can find this on your book on page... It's on page 16 up to page... 21 okay just read it all over again so that it will retain in your mind okay now let oh we already review a while ago Teacher, do we need let to me do just the yes activity? sorry what is it do you need to do the activity at home uh we will all do those experiments those ex those activity when you come back to school, okay? We need to do it at school, okay? okay. Yes? All okay. right. Now let's review. I will just read, you listen, okay? I summarize all the lesson. Just listen to teacher. Infancy, birth to two years. They are unable to see well. They cannot walk and feed themselves. They express themselves by crying and bubbling. For childhood, 3 to 11 years old, they learn how to walk and talk. They can do simple tasks. For adolescents, 12 to 18 years old, puberty happens. The body goes through many changes. For boys, puberty happens when they are 12 to 16 and for, girl, and for girls 10 to 14. Now, during adulthood, this is the stable, sta stable stage. They may reproduce and start a family. Now, for old age, their body become weaker. Their eyesight may also weaken. They, their hair starts to turn gray. Okay? That's the all information about our lesson today. All right. Now, do you want to answer some activity in your book? Get your book. Open it on page. It's on page. 21st. 21. Finish. You finish it already? Yes. How come? You answered it I, earlier? I did it until chapter 3. Wow! Sherman, you're doing advanced reading? Yes. No, I also write this book too. Mm. Until chapter 3. Wow, good job. Okay, now ready? Let's answer. Wait. It's on page 21 on your class book. Uh, show me your books. Do you have your books with you? Your pencil? Okay, ready to answer? Now, the direction here is state if the statement is true or false. Write T for true and F for false. Ready? Ready. Okay, now let's read. Stop writing on the screen. Okay. Now let's read number one. Let's read all together. A five-month-old baby... False. It's called newborn. True false. or false? 
false. F. False. Why false? Because two bones, two bones of because two two months old baby is called newborn. This is yeah, five months. Very good. Okay. From birth to two year to two months, we call them newborn. When they exceed two months, they are not newborn anymore. That's why F or false is the answer. Finish, yeah. number one. Finish. Okay, for number two, let's Finish. Go. Childhood yeah. comes after infancy. True or false? False. Childhood comes after infancy. True or false? The answer is true. Right. P. Finish. Finish. Okay. Next, let's read number three. Adult. Finish. Adults go through puberty. True or false? False. False. Why false? Why false? Because adulthood is the physically mature age and adolescence goes through puberty, not adults. Okay? Finish. Finish. Okay, now number four, let's read. An elderly person falls ill more easily than an adult. True or false? True or false? What's the answer? The answer is? T. T or true. Okay, finish. Yeah. All right, show me your book. Finish. Show me your book. Okay, very good. Sherman, Galaxy Tab, Palawat, Nanapat. How about what she wrote and the other? Show your books. Oh, Tonka, oh, your sister is so cute. Very good, Pimpes. Okay. Everyone finish. All right, now let's proceed to page 24. Page 24 on your book, this one. Ready? What page? 24. What page? page 24. Page 24. Ready? Did you Ready. find it? Ready. Ready. Okay, now let's read number one. The eyesight of blank becomes better as they grow. What's the answer? Newborns. Newborns. Very good. Right? Newborns on your book. Finish, Sherman? Finish. All of it? Yes. Wow. Finish, number one? Finish. Yes. Finish. Yes. Finish. Okay, number two. The reproductive organs of a person start to develop during puberty. Puberty. Very good. Sherman, do you know the answer for number three? Yes. Whoa. You did read your book, huh? Finish. Yes. Finish. Okay, for number three, the body produces blank because changes during puberty. What's the answer? Hormones. Hormones. Okay. Adolescents are having pimples or acne because of hormones. Okay. Hormones. I told you. I can't. 
You're finished, Herman, huh? Yes. Good. Job. How about your other subjects like grammar and English? Are you doing advanced reading as well? Yes. Ooh. Grandma, I don't know. I'm in chapter nine like that. I don't know. Oh. Okay, now for number four. After adolescence, a person enters blank and then into old age. Adult who? Oh, me. The answer is adulthood. Adulthood. You think number five? I can answer. You are fast. You will answer some of the questions on your workbook next week, okay? Today, just the class book. Next week, we will answer your workbook, the other book. Finish? Finish. Do you know the Finish. answer for number five? Yes. Finish. Okay, now for number five. When we grow quickly, we experience a growth? Spurt. Ooh. Okay. Yes. <laughs> Where did you find the answer, Sherman? I did it by myself. Very good. Finish. I read it. I read it. I read the book and I come to answer. I remember it. Wow, you have a sharp memory. Yes, my memory is the best. <laughs> what? My memory is the best in the world. <laughs> this is the best. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Yes, I can be China. I can be Italy. Yay! Do you want to be like Albert Einstein? Uh, who's that? Oh, <laughs> you don't uh, know him? I win, Albert! Finish, everyone! <laughs> Finish! Let me see your book. Finish! 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 Let me see your book. Finish! Oh, okay. Let me see your book. Finish! So if you answer it. Very good, you press about the others. Go ahead, show me your book. I should be ready. Okay, good job. Yeah. Huh? Class book, this one. Page 21 and page 24. Very good, your guard. Oh, teacher. Teacher. Yes. Good job, read me. Next time you listen to me. Next time you have to change your username into your English name, okay? Yes. Okay. Yes. Is is my one right? That's my one name. Is my one right? Yes. The others. I'm referring to others. Son, are you finished, son? Yes. Let me see. And next time you have to open your camera, okay? Yes. Kapon, finish? Yes. I said show it your show your book to me. I wanna see. Okay, good job. Now, do you have any questions or clarifications about the lesson for today? Do you have any questions? Yes or no? Teacher, can I add your line? Yes, you can add me online and ask me your clarifications, okay? Or you can also message me on Messenger me. if you have questions. Okay? Oh, open your camera, everyone. We'll take a photo before we say goodbye. Hi, Mel. 
Take the camera first. Sure. Bring school. Hold on, hold on, One, two, three. Yeah. 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 Okay, that's all for today. We still have five minutes. So I will talk to you first. I have a great day, teacher. Huh? Have a great day.